Stress has proven to tax our health, so to lessen the worry of money matters, Senior Wealth Advisor Darren Farwell of the Farwell Group joins us. He'll give us solid financial advice for 2021. Good morning, Darren, and Happy New Year. Thank you, Marilyn. Happy New Year to you. In fact, this is my first time speaking with From a Woman's Perspective listeners in 2021, so Happy New Year to everyone out there. And here's to hoping for a year more full of meeting with friends and family in person. Well, on that note, I don't need to tell anyone out there that the pandemic, which you know began in 2020, has brought with it a world of changes. Of course, some things will go back to the way they were, so to speak, but many things will not. And this way, it is indeed a whole new world out there, including in investments and earning a reliable sustainable income. It's a whole new world out there for investing. Earning a rate of return is getting harder and harder, and the returns you do earn seem to be going lower. So my question today, is your portfolio set up properly to deal with these changes? And furthermore, can you afford to live in comfort through the rest of your life earning lower returns? I mean, Marilyn, you've probably even got better stories than I do, but my first mortgage in 1986 was 12.25%. My son just got a five-year mortgage for 1.65. That's not fair. It's amazing, though. (laughs) It's just mind-boggling. And I, I remember quite clearly bonds like Canada Savings Bonds, and I wasn't owning bonds those days. I owed money. I didn't have extra money. Bonds like Canada Savings Bonds were paying double-digit, 100% guaranteed returns. Now, guaranteed rates like GICs pay 0.75%, less than 1%, of course, at a time when I actually have some savings. Again, not fair, but that's just the way the world is. In 2020, technology-focused indexes went up 18% on the year. The Canadian bank stocks without dividends reinvested, went down 1.45 for the year. Yeah, sure, Canadian banks, in fact, U.S. and European banks, are forecast to do much better in 2021. But regardless, the world has changed around investing. Janice watched our video video called Shockproofing Your Income. Uh, That video is available to listeners if anybody uh, would like to see it, as Janice did. And then she called me a little worried. After her husband died a few years ago, her advisor, uh, actually sort of her husband's advisor, suggested that she de-risk her portfolio. Now, Janice mentioned actually that at the time, she didn't even know what that meant. He told her that her portfolio had too many stocks and that would be too risky for her. As a result, now she has a portfolio that's 30% in stocks and mostly Canadian bank stocks, and 70% in cash and low-risk bonds and GICs. The numbers were in. Last year, Janice earned 1.4%. At 1.4%, Janice will run out of savings at age 86. Now, she'll still have her house, and she can sell her house and get equity from that. She will still have her Canada pension plan and old age security and some corporate uh, pension from her late husband. But running out of savings at age 86, that's too young. On my team, we have many female clients that are older than age 86. Janice's portfolio is simply not well-suited for the new world out there. Janice is still quite young, 74 years old. Her savings need to work for her. So clearly, it was time for her to review her investments in light of the new investment world out there. During our three-step process... When we got to know the way we get to know prospective clients, I learned a lot about Janice's comfort with the ups and downs of the market and seeing the value of her portfolio changing month to month. And unlike what the previous advisor has said, Janice is actually seems quite relaxed around monthly variation in in the value of her uh, her portfolios and her monthly statement. I also learned a lot about what's important to her, and she definitely wants to leave a legacy both to her children and her university, where she received her master's degree and met her late husband. Being independent of her children for her financial well-being is also very important to her. 
as a result, her, her savings have to work for her. And her current 1.4% pre-tax won't do it. Now, we've designed portfolios to participate in stock market gains while minimizing losses. So you don't have to lose sleep at night. They are balanced portfolios with investments and diversification suited for the way the world is today. By working with Janice, we were able to identify ways to increase her return and at the same time lower her taxes. Therefore, because it's a whole new world for investments out there, I recommend you do three things. Number one, review your long-term financial plan. Are your return forecasts still appropriate for the way things are today, or do you need to recalculate based on today's forecast? Number two, if you don't have a long-term financial plan yet, get one. And number three, review the investments in your portfolio. Are they the right ones for today? Or you could do something else. You could just call us, and we'll help ensure that you're on track, like Janice, to look after those things that are most important to you. Well, since the first day I ever met you, you always valued a second opinion. And it didn't have to be yours. You just explained that people needed to have a fresh pair of eyes review what was going on. And that was a long time before pre-pandemic, Darren. But a balanced portfolio sounds great. A good return and less tax sounds great. It's a win-win, and I guess having this shock-proofing your income document would be wonderful as well. So if someone wants to talk to you and have a second pair of eyes on what they're doing and make sure that they're ready for the new normal, how do we reach you? You can call 416-863-7501, and we'll be glad to speak with you and figure out the best way to give you you know, a, a second opinion, or as you said, another set of eyes in your portfolio relative to the way things are today. We have to live right now. We can't wait for the future and evolve from there. So deal with it while you have the time. Call Darren Farwell and the Farwell Group at 416-863-7501. You'll learn how to shockproof your income and know if you're on the right track. Thank you, Darren. I look forward to speaking to you next week. All right. Always good to speak with you, Marilyn. Bye for now.